in the beginning, it was just Milan, Paris, and London sort of slotted itself in. I think I could spend half of the year traveling, going to different fashion weeks now. There's an appetite for fashion. As, as digital media has really opened up fashion to a global consumer, it's become part of the popular culture around the world. You get to some cities and you know, they really like kind of lay it on thick with like champagne bars. But then you have like some fashion weeks that really just do their own thing. There's fashion weeks that I've attended in different parts of the world that for different reasons have found their own voice. I think it really comes down to knowing A, who your audience is, and B, what you can offer that's different or special. So my name is Daria Shapovalova and I am the creative director for Fashion Week in Kiev. We decided that this event should not be only about fashion, but also, for example, about education. Fashion relies on new talent, on new blood, and we have a lot of young people who want to create. I think nobody quite knows how many Fashion Weeks there are around the world. They're, they're now innumerable. It's impossible to have a schedule that will take in every single you know, fashion show in the world. And at the same time, it's, it's sad to just limit it to the four. There is a lot of, of other stuff in the world. I mean, I just think that like, you don't need to go to Paris to see African fashion. I think somebody coming out of a university in Berlin, for example, has the opportunity to be able to show their work. Definitely as an initial stepping stone, it's, it encourages people to start. The more brands that are out there trying to do new things, the more exciting the industry becomes. I'm even considering going to Lagos for their fashion week. Just considering it. 